Hello and welcome to this quick tips video which is about uh, right click in the media base. So media base Steinberg's all in one solution for all of your media which um, yeah it kind of works. It's not always that useful but the basic use of it is what most people do do which is if you open it up you can search for something so for instance here we've got some acoustic guitar track which is you know inoffensive enough I guess and the normal use is you'd probably just double click this that whacks into your project on a new track and away you go. However, there is uh, some more you can do. And the thing in this video is to right click or two finger tap if you're on a MacBook, etc. You get a menu. It's got a few useful things. So firstly, if you've got the right kind of media, it will create a sampler track. It will allow you to insert it into your project, not just where we just double click, but at cursor, left locator or origin. So origin is the time which is stamped into it, which in most of these is zero anyway. And most importantly, we can search for things which are useful. So setting up the logical part of the search can be maybe beyond uh, some people's bother limit, if nothing else, but we can search for any attribute which has been set. So in this case, I'm going to search for tempo. It's 126, which is off the bottom of the screen, unfortunately, but you will see it come up here. So here we've got this logical search. In this particular case, it only comes up with the project uh, this particular rock and pop toolbox because that's the only thing in the media bay which has got a search for a tempo of 126 but we can try something else so let's search for the key and here we get some other things which are in the same key so that could offer you some useful possibilities and remember you can always alter them afterwards so if we go back to searching on tempo we can always modify this so maybe greater or equal than, et cetera, in range. So we can add a range of 126 to maybe 130. And it allows you to modify this and play around with it. But it's a good way to start a logical search rather than you having to do it all from scratch. So that's your quick tip for today. As ever, I hope you found that useful. And if you have, please like us, subscribe, discuss, etc. And we'll see you again soon for more Music Tech Tuition.